Alright, what is going on? Ladies and gentlemen, it's your boy Freaks here today, and I have a story for you guys. I have been in the hospital many times. I've been in there for surgery, I've been in there for smashing my throat through my fucking head, but y you know, you get the point. I've been there plenty, and uh, one thing I've never ever done is gone into an ambulance and go into the hospital up in an ambulance, and I know you guys are probably like, why the fuck are you like, why, why do you kind of wish to do that? Well, I mean... It's just something I've always wanted to do. I thought it'd be a fun experience, but yesterday I finally got to it, and uh, no, it definitely was not a fun fucking experience. So I really apologize. <coughs> Holy shit, that voice cracked. But I really apologize for the shortness of this video. I'm just really exhausted and just mentally not okay to make a full-on cut commentary, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. I'm just really tired and exhausted. But yesterday I uh, I took my medication, and before I used to take Ciprolex. 20 milligrams, but I ended up getting switched over to this other green bullshit pill, and uh, I took five, and it's never affected me in any bad way, it's always been alright, but then one I took yesterday, I took it at about 1 o'clock, and then by 1.15, I was on the ground, and I didn't know what the fuck was happening, I felt just nauseous, dizzy, sick, disoriented, I couldn't like find myself, I didn't understand where what was going on, I didn't understand anything, and uh, Thankfully, my girlfriend was there. I really appreciate her presence there and her being, you know, strong and stuff yesterday. But, yeah, it was a pretty scary exper experience. I mean, I didn't know... I didn't even know my street address. Like, that's fucked. I only thing I could tell was I lived in Kamloops. That's all the things I knew. That's it. So, uh, yesterday, we ended up, you know, hanging out and stuff like that. And I'm like... I was really disoriented. She saw that. I felt sick and all that. And she's like are you good? And I was like, I, I don't know. I, I don't know what's going on. What's going on, Megan? What is going on? And I just, I had no idea of anything going on around me. And I got my name, but it took me a good, at least 10 minutes to actually remember it. Like it, it was really fucked up. So, uh, I went up to the hospital and then, oh God, answering questions was the hardest thing ever. I mean, when you can't even remember your name barely, it's hard to answer any questions that people ask you. Like, I was really starting to get fed up with it. So then, the medication started giving me a bunch of side effects, because obviously I was having some sort of weird reaction to it. But the side effects were uh, really kind of funny, not gonna lie. I mean, it's pretty laughable. I was, uh, arms in the air. Like, literally arms in the air. My arms were raised for three hours. Like, I was just chilling there. And then whenever the nurse would come up, she'd be like, are you okay? I'll be like, yeah, I'm good. And I'm all drugged up at this point. They're trying to keep me safe and all that. And she's like, are you okay? I'm like, yeah, I'm good. And she goes, well, do you know what you're doing? I was like, I'm in the hospital. And she goes, well, well why are your arms in the air? And I go, well, it's comfortable, you see. And she goes, okay, you know, okay, cool. But, uh, yeah, it was really scary. Uh, I'm kind of okay now. I wouldn't say I'm at the best recovery point right now, but I'm definitely better than I was yesterday. Yesterday was scary. I didn't know what was going on. It scared everybody. But, uh, yeah, I thought I'd kind of inform you guys. I'm really sorry that this video is not, like, funny or anything, but that's what happened yesterday and, uh, some scary shit, and I just don't have the energy to make a video. I still feel a little dizzy, still a little uneasy, but, uh, you know, that'll go away in time, but just let you guys know I'm good, I'm safe. Regular videos will come out tomorrow. I'm maybe going to try my best to make a follow video or something like that. But anyways, in the meantime, I hope you guys have a fantastic day, evening, night. I don't give a shit. Have a fantastic day in general. I'll talk to you all later. Stay positive and peace out.